Welcome to the channel, and welcome to another video. Canada's healthcare system is often held up as a model of universal healthcare, but it's essential to understand that healthcare in Canada is a provincial responsibility. As such, there are differences in healthcare systems across the country. In this video, we'll try to get a basic understanding of the Canadian healthcare system, its variations between provinces, funding mechanisms, health insurance, and what services are covered and not covered. Provincial Variations in Coverage Canada is a vast country with 10 provinces and 3 territories, and each has its own healthcare system. The federal government sets national standards and provides financial support through the Canada Health Transfer. However, the provinces have significant autonomy in managing their healthcare systems. This autonomy results in variations in services, wait times, and access to healthcare resources. For instance, some provinces offer better access to specialists or have shorter wait times for elective surgeries, while others may prioritize different aspects of care, such as mental health services or preventative measures. Funding Mechanism the Canadian healthcare system is primarily publicly funded, with the government covering a significant portion of healthcare costs. Funding comes from a combination of federal and provincial territorial sources. The federal government provides funding through the Canada Health Transfer, while provincial and territorial governments collect taxes to fund healthcare services. Healthcare expenses are usually the largest budget item for provincial governments. Health Insurance Health insurance in Canada is provided through a publicly funded system. Every Canadian citizen and permanent resident is eligible for provincial or territorial health insurance, which covers medically necessary hospital and physician services. The system is often referred to as Medicare. What's covered and what's not? Medicare typically covers doctor visits and consultations, hospital stays and surgeries, emergency care, laboratory and diagnostic tests, some preventative services, medically necessary procedures. However, it's important to note that not everything is covered by Medicare. Dental care, vision care, prescription drugs outside of hospitals, and most types of home care are not covered. Canadians often rely on private insurance, employer-sponsored insurance plans, or out-of-pocket expenses for these services. Challenges and Criticisms Despite being a point of pride for many Canadians, the healthcare system faces several challenges. Wait times Long wait times for non-emergency surgeries and specialist consultations are a common concern. Access to specialists Access to specialists can be uneven across provinces, leading to disparities in care. Aging population Canada's aging population places additional strain on the healthcare system as older individuals often require more medical care. Pharmaceutical costs The cost of prescription drugs is not consistently covered, leading to affordability issues for some patients. Canada's healthcare system is a point of national pride, but it's not without its challenges. The system's success lies in its commitment to universal access, but it also highlights the need for ongoing improvement and investment in healthcare infrastructure. Understanding the differences between provinces is crucial for Canadians to navigate their unique healthcare landscape effectively. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and leave your thoughts in the comments section below. Don't forget to subscribe.